Come on in. How y'all doing? Welcome to my channel. This is Amazing Grace. I declare and decree that Jesus Christ is the head of my life. It's coming on to share the word. Hallelujah. May you be blessed by God's word. I'm coming today from Psalms 12. And it reads, Help, Lord, for the godly man cease, cease, for the faithful fail from among the children of men. They speak vanity, every one with his neighbor, with flattering lips, and with a double heart do they speak. The Lord should cut off all flattering lips, and the tongue that speaketh proud things, who have said, with our tongue will we prevail. Our lips, our own, who is Lord over us? For the oppression of the poor, for the signing of the needy, nor will I rise, said the Lord. Now will I rise, says the Lord. I will set him in safety from him that puffeth at him. The words of the Lord are pure words, as civil, civil tried in a furnace of earth. Purified seven times. Thou shalt keep them. O Lord, thou shalt preserve them from this generation forever. The wicked walk on every side when the vilest men are exalted. Hallelujah. Thank you. And may y'all be blessed with God's word. Hallelujah. It keeps me day by day. Hallelujah. If it wasn't for the Lord on my side, where would I be? And I just want to share his word with you today. Give somebody some hope. Encourage you to hold on to God on change your hand. Be your best self. Treat others the way you want to be treated. Love God in yourself. Take care of all your loved ones. Check on the elder. Help with the poor and needy. And watch the Lord bless you. God over your tongue. Do nothing evil and wicked in thy sight. Govern yourself. Be your best virgin. Reading God's word and let him make you over. I'm so glad I did and do. I see God in all his ways. And I lean not on my understanding, but I lean on him and his promises. And I look to the hills will come my help and my strength. I can't tell you enough about what the Lord has done for me. He's taken me from many graves and many ditches and homeless to having my own home. Somewhere to call home, you know, out of the ailments. I can cook my own food today. I ain't living in nobody's house to get mistreated or the Lord keeps me and I'm so glad about it. He make ways out of no ways for me. He fight he fight the demonic and the devil for my name's sake. He keeps me with his right hand. Him and his host that protect me. And my ancestors. Yes, I lean on God's promise, his word. And he ain't failed me yet. All the glory belong to Jesus Christ. And not to me. Hallelujah. So I'm sitting here today being honored. I'm, I'm honored to share my life, my testimony, the goodness of God. Don't forget to share and follow me, comment, come in day by day as I share my journey, living with COPD, becoming an author, hallelujah, living a life as a saint, 
a, a minister, a prophet, a child of the Most High God. He has his hands on me. Cry and see me through. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Thank you, Father God. Oh, glory. Oh, glory. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. For you are my way maker, my strong tower. You say you deny anybody to deny you. I confess to the world that I belong to you. And that you are my father, my way maker, my redeemer, my everything, my best friend, my creator. The breath in my body comes from Jesus Christ. The breath in your body comes from Jesus Christ. You didn't create yourself. None of us did. We wonderfully made in Jesus Christ's image. Yeah. And this kinky wig. Comes from the most high. Ain't that so pretty? Well, this your girl. Your queen, your princess. Amazing grace. Keep doing good. Keep seeking God. In everything you do, be still and know that he is the I am. He's the on time God. He won't leave you or forsake you. Yes. In the midnight hour, you'll turn it around. Fight all your battles. Put money in your pocket, dry your tears. He's an awesome God. Don't give up. Seek him. I'm here to testify. My life has been way better than I could ever imagine. Who would ever thought that I'd be called an author or a prophet or a minister? I'm a productive member of society today. When they close the doors in my face, the Lord opened up two or three more. Everything that the devil meant to kill me, God turned it around for my good. And I give him all the glory and all the praise. Keep seeking him. Seek God in all his kingdom and all his righteousness. And he'll devour the devil for your name's sake. Call and cry out to him. He hears you. He sees you. He know all about it. Confess all your sins and tell him you don't want that life no more. And walk with Jesus and your life will change. Well, this amazing grace, sharing, and sharing my testimony, giving somebody some experience, strength, and hope. May you all be blessed today. In Jesus Christ's mighty name, I say amen.